Hey all, this is Reddit Tosker. In Dragon's Dogma 2, there are a total of 10 vocations. You start off with the first four, and in this video I'm going to show you how to unlock the other six. For the most part, this video is going to be spoiler-free. I'm only going to be talking about the conditions for unlocking the new vocations. But that means that I'll have to show you on the map where to go, and how to get there from other well-known places. I'll also have to talk about whatever quests are involved with getting the vocations, if they are tied to a quest. Alright, let's just start. The first two are the Sorcerer and Warrior classes, and those are unlocked at the same time. Soon after starting the game, you'll be pointed towards the capital of Vernworth, and once you've made it inside, you'll be able to start the quest. You begin the quest by going to Klaus. He is the vocation guy. The quest is called Vocation Frustration. You go from Klaus to the weaponsmith, and he will direct you to a goblin cave in Trevor Mine. The location of the cave is marked on your map, once there, the weapons are not particularly hidden, they are just in ornate chests. Once you find both of them, you can return back to town, complete the quest, and unlock the new vocations. The third vocation you can unlock is the Mystic Spearhand. Once you get to Vernworth, you need to do one main story quest. The story quests in Vernworth are handled by Captain Brant. Brant will ask you to come to the tavern at night, and he'll have three quests that you can choose from. Complete any one of those three quests, and then you need to return to Melv, a town that you have previously been in. There's an ox cart you can take in Vernworth's North Gate. When you go back to Melv after completing one of Brant's quests, a lesser dragon will have attacked the city. And during this attack, you'll see a Mystic Spearhand guy fighting the dragon alongside of you. You probably can't kill it, but once you chase it away, be sure to talk to the Mystic Spearhand guy, his name is Sigurd, and just talking to him and asking about his vocation is enough to give you access to it. The next vocation you can unlock is the Trickster. The Trickster is in Batal. She's to the southeast of the Checkpoint Rest Town in the Batal area. This is her location on the map and how to get there from the Checkpoint. Now, this is the only vocation where I'm not 100% sure of its unlock conditions. I'm fairly certain you don't have to do anything and you can just talk to the person here and you'll get the vocation as a result. But if for some reason that doesn't work, then what will work for sure is if you just proceed to Batal, do the main story objectives there until you get to a point where someone asks you to go look for the Oracle, at which point you can come back here and that will give you the vocation for sure. Again, I don't think that's necessary, I think you will just get it from talking to her. But I mention it just in case. The next vocation is the Magic Archer. This one is found in the Volcanic Island region. In order to get this, you need to head down this southerly route from Batal until you get to Dravnir's Grotto. This is a lengthy dungeon, and it will come out on the other side in the Volcano Island region. Soon after coming out the other side, you will encounter a dwarf. The dwarf will have a quest that asks you to get him some herbs. Do that, and then meet him later at his house, which will be here. From there, the dwarf will ask you to take him to some hot springs over at the town nearby. Escort the dwarf there, and once you do, his wife will speak to you, giving you access to the new vocation. And while you're in this town, you'll be able to get the last vocation, the Warfarer. He's located near the hot springs, and in order to unlock his class and be able to use it, you need to give him Newt Liquor. You can get Newt Liquor from Batal. Go over to Higgs Tavern Stand while you're wearing a Beastron Mask. You can get a Beastron Mask from the Counterfeiter in the Checkpoint Town. Then you pick up a pile of burlap sacks and put it in this fenced area. You'll then be taken inside and be able to purchase the Newt Liquor. And that's it. That's how you unlock all six vocations. That's the end of this video. As always, thank you very much for watching.